the James Webb Space Telescope. You may call it JWST or simply Webb, will be a large infrared telescope with a 6.5 meter primary mirror. The telescope will be launched on an Ariana 5 rocket from French Guiana on 31st October 2021. JWST was formerly known as the Next Generation Space Telescope, NGST. It was renamed in September 2002 after a former NASA administrator, James E. Webb, who ran the fledgling space agency from February 1961 to October 1968. Webb is an international collaboration between NASA, the European Space Agency ESA and the Canadian Space Agency CSA. The James Webb Space Telescope will be the premier space observatory for astronomers ever placed in orbit. Webb is 100 times more powerful than Hubble. It is so big that it has to fold origami style to fit in the rocket and will unfold like a transformer in space. The biggest infrared astronomical telescope, the James Webb Space Telescope is heralded as the successor to NASA's storied Hubble Space Telescope. The launch of the James Webb Space Telescope will be a giant step forward in the human quest to understand our place in the universe. The Webb Telescope will examine every phase of our history, from the first galaxies to form after the Big Bang to the formation and evolution of planetary systems capable of supporting life, to the history of our own solar system. JWST will be a powerful time machine with infrared vision that will peer back over 13.5 billion years to see the first stars and galaxies forming out of the darkness of the early universe. JWST's unprecedented infrared sensitivity will help astronomers to compare the faintest, earliest galaxies to today's grand spirals and ellipticals, helping us to understand how galaxies assemble over billions of years. JWST will be able to see right through and into massive clouds of dust that are opaque to visible light observatories like Hubble, where stars and planetary systems are being born. JWST will tell us more about the atmospheres of extrasolar planets and perhaps even find the building blocks of life elsewhere in the universe. The observatory of the James Webb Space Telescope is comprised of three elements. The Integrated Science Instrument Module ISIM, the Optical Telescope Element OTE, which includes the mirrors and backplane, and the spacecraft element, which includes the spacecraft bus and sun shield. The Webb Telescope will have a large 6.5 meter primary mirror that will collect 7 times more light than Hubble's mirror. Webb's is made up of 18 mirror segments that will act as one. The mirror segments will be folded up and put inside the rocket for launch. This is a group photo of James Webb Space Telescope project members with the complete Integrated Science Instrument module ISIM. The ISIM includes a near-infrared camera, NIR cam, a near-infrared spectrograph, NIR spec, a mid-infrared instrument, MIRI and a fine guidance sensor FGS. All objects, even the coldest ones, for example an ice cube, emit a certain amount of heat radiation, that is infrared radiation. The universe is full of cool objects, including planets, dust and aging stars, none of which usually shine brightly in the visible part of the spectrum and could not be observed directly until sensitive infrared detectors came along. The cool universe is therefore best studied in the infrared. The large primary mirror of the Webb's telescope will be passively cooled by a sun shield to about 45 Kelvin. It will be sensitive to light from 0.6 to 28.5 micrometers. The sharp infrared vision of the James Webb Space Telescope will help astronomers address a number of key questions concerning our place in the evolving universe.
the JWST will help us to determine the geometry of the universe and enable us to establish whether the universe will continue to expand forever or will eventually decelerate under the influence of gravity from the matter within it. A special point in space 1.5 million kilometers from Earth is particularly stable and favorable for a spacecraft. It is called L2 or the second Earth Sun Lagrange point, and this is where the James Webb Space Telescope will be parked. JWST will be operated in a manner similar to the Hubble Space Telescope. The Space Telescope Science Institute will take on responsibility for the scientific exploitation of the observatory and its instruments after successful commissioning. Astronomers have made giant step in our understanding of the universe over the past decades, but there remain much to learn about our cosmic origins and the range of questions waiting to be answered have high expectations. It will be a huge leap forward on the day when Ariana 5 rocket will lift off from French Guiana to place the James Webb Space Telescope in the orbit. We eagerly awaits the contributions and discoveries that James Webb will make in the future.